Hey, good morning, it's Nathan here from Pioneer. I'm here to talk to you about the new CA600 software computer from Pioneer. Um, this is a relatively new unit. Um, it's, a, it's an amazing product. We have uh, essentially more uh, functionality in this building this little unit than collectively uh, all of the competition across, across the board. Um, Wi-Fi, AMP Plus, and private Bluetooth um, does it all. Uh, there's even a networking feature between different riders called uh, Live Partner that you can tap in and ride with your friends and see what they're doing and see how they, you can see how they're doing. Um, it's an amazing feature. Turn by turn direction is also in there. Something we've been badgered about for the last uh, couple of years. People have been wanting more and more. Um, we have that. Um, we also have uh, obviously phone calls, text messages, emails. You stay connected that way. Um, automatically uploads to the app after the after the ride straight on uh, your on your smartphone here. So. Um, stays in contact the entire time, keeps you, keeps you connected, um, check it out. If you don't have a Bluetooth power meter, it's no problem. With the CS600, you can actually use the Bluetooth bridge feature and it can receive an AMP Plus signal and then broadcast out a Bluetooth uh, transmission signal for your Apple TV for Zwift, for example. So, nice little feature there, something else that, uh, that Pioneer is totally unique with. Another one of the cool features of the CA600, it actually has a feature called FEC Protocol Support, which is Smart Trainer Control. So essentially what you can do is you can take this computer from your ride from the day before or the morning of, um, one that you've done in your history file, and you can create, uh, it automatically creates a file in there that you can then drive your Smart Trainer with. So you can connect your kicker or your or your or uh, any of your Smart Trainers, for example, to the head unit as a sensor and then you would do a simulation mode so you can simulate a ride that you already did or even better you can actually create a route and load it into there that you haven't done before and you can still ride the, you can still simulate the route from the created file you just put in there so very easy to do again it's all done through the smart control app on the phone um, it's called control it's free in the ios app store or in the android google play store